Any other boost pump on? Yeah, fuel pump, go ahead. Alrighty, when you're ready, you come on up. So, aft, right cyclic as required. Remember, you're going to come up and then slide to your left. You're clear left, center, right. 100%, overhead switches, right pedal, right pedal, right pedal. There you go, stop it, keep coming, keep coming. Pull, 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 pull. And slide to the left, slide left. That altitude, don't come back down on your landing area. Okay, stop. Look at your rotor RPM. There you go. That's it, just get your hover legs back. You can practice a couple pedal turns, left, right, whatever you need to do, just get used to flying it again. I know it's been a day. Alright, just a couple light cells out there. You can practice setting it down right here, nice and easy. Right skid, remember to throttle, rolls down a little bit as you touch down. Lower the collective, there you go, that's about flight idle now, and then go ahead, when you pick it back up, a little aft and right cyclic, nice and slow, continuous pull, throttle, there you go. Alright, I have all controls. Yep, I have all controls. So we'll uh, practice the uh, hovering auto, right, so just a slow reduction, right? Just like that. I'll show you one more time. I will do the throttle manipulation. All you got to do is just fly her. Okay. Check it. 100% on the rotor RPM. Temperatures, pressures, normal. Overhead switches are good. Nice slow pickup. Little throttle got behind the power curve, so we'll just get it all back up there. All right. So about stable, six inches to one foot over flat terrain here. And then, uh, so what happens if you lose the engine at the hover? What do you gotta do? That's gonna be just pedal, settle, pull. What that means is left pedal to keep the direction of the nose, let it settle, and then you pull with the collective to cushion it, right? So it's pedal, settle, pull. I didn't need all that left pedal that you saw as you went over. So proportional amount there. And she'll keep flying for a while, you see. All right. Coming back up. All right, you have all controls? I have control. I'm going to do it real slow the first time, so all you got to do is just keep her straight better than I did. If you have a sudden stoppage, you'll need a good amount of left pedal. But it's just a slight left pedal at this point. All right, you ready? In three, two, one. You see how it's coming down. There you go. Didn't need that much pedal on it, huh? Nope. I started kicking I do it, it over, it, and then yeah. it went over too when much. When I do it slow, it's just a gradual left okay. pedal. So that's why I went too far to the left. In an actual stoppage, I, I had to hit full left pedal. When the engine stopped suddenly, yeah. I was like, bam! It was just instinctive. All right, go ahead, pick it back up. You know, as far as, like, practical test standards, we're kind of trying to see no more than, you know, 10... 10 degrees of nose deviation. We don't want to climb up. We're a nice smooth touchdown, so. And a three, two, one, power's coming down. A little bit more collective. You need to add more collective next time, okay? Collective? Okay. Collective to cushion it. Okay. 
So you could basically, as the throttle's coming down, you could be pulling up and okay. pushing it as it comes down. Yeah, I wasn't manipulating that because I thought you were, so I'll pull it up. Yep, that's it. I'm just doing the throttle, you got all the collective. Okay. There you go. I went the wrong way with the throttle. I felt it. I gotta fix it. Yep. Alrighty, in three, two, one. Just pull the collective, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Oh, that's perfect. What we want to see. Good. And then once you touch down, you can lower the collective. But you saw that, how it cushions yeah. it as you come up? Yeah. I mean, your, your rotor RPM is like decayed big time there, but it's fine. Using whatever built up energy is the cushion of landing. Some people like to land like that. Like they'll do it like a hovering auto just to get it down on the ground. Wow. Kind of tough on the uh, helicopter. Well, you can get it really smooth. You can be very smooth with it. There you go, and we'll do it one more time. And three, two, one, and it's coming down. You're pulling up, pulling up. There you go, see? Much better, see? All right, and then lower the collective back down. Go. Roll it back up. Good job. Our information, Quebec, time one three five two. Andrew is back. Wind one zero zero at six. Yep. Visibility six miles of haze. Scatter clouds at one thousand seven hundred. Scatter clouds at two thousand six hundred. Shimmer three one two point two five. And the altimeters three zero two five. We're landing the port and runway niner. Expect a GPS approach. Find out to this one thousand feet. Alrighty. Want to go out and uh, what do you want to do? Autos? Yeah, we'll do the autos again. Okay. All right, I have all controls. Yeah, I'll control. I uh, have control. I'll take off here in the taxiway again. More of the advanced maneuver just in case something did happen here. Space Coast Tower, helicopter 8006 Alpha. Helicopter 8006 Alpha, Space Coast Tower. Helicopter 8006 Alpha, Southeast T Hangar Ramp. Information Quebec, like present position departure. Uh, Park the pad here to join the traffic pattern runway 9. Helicopter 8006 Alpha, Space Coast Tower. Departure from the ramp will be a pilot's own risk. Report midfield left downwind runway 9. Departure at our own risk. Report midfield left downwind runway 9. Helicopter 06 Alpha. All we'll right. Drive that way and to the left, right? You got it. We're on the left. The max performance takeoff here. Get the airspeed on her. Back her down. Tiger still, 764, 545. Head down, RNAV, runway 9. Request that can go for southbound departure. 64545, Space of Tower, Roger, report crossing over Interstate 95. Report, report crossing over Damn, you lose an engine right here, you put it right there? I would. I'm not going to fly over that lake, I can tell you that. Alrighty, you can come on the controls with me. Power is set, about 36 indicated. A little bit of forward sick for 65, I was still yep. accelerating. And just fly your left traffic pattern. You got all the calls. Just remember your hat, make sure that's on there so it doesn't go flying up on you. My hat? Yeah, yeah I just checked it. Okay. Space Coast Tower, helicopter 8006 Alpha, midfield left downwind, runway 9. Helicopter 06 Alpha, runway 9, clear for the option. Clear for the option, runway 9, uh, helicopter 8006 Alpha. Okay, Keep it inside buddy. the perimeter again. Yeah, if you're going to just do uh, straight in, you could turn right at Grissom. 
and we can enter once you're on the final. We'll start with the straight ends. Remember the ditty is down, left, aft, down, collective, all the way in the pocket initial. You left pedal, aft, cyclic. And once you're established, wait for your rotor RPM to build up. You'll check the rotor, pitching for about 70 miles an hour. Then it's a rotor RPM, airspeed, and the landing area assured. You're ready, 1,000 feet, turn over Grissom. You're being cleared for the low approach. Do it or do you want to do it? Oh, you got it. Just lined up on the final. We got plenty of runway in front of you, so we're not doing any specific game points now. Right. Just practicing the entry. So once you get a line. Attention, oh. aircraft aviation Romeo is current out to my 3025. And 3, 2, 1, down. Collective all the way down, all the way down. There you go. Rotor, airspeed, landing area. Finder landing area. A little bit less left pedal, a little bit of right pedal. There you go, keep her in trip. Uh, we have a Romeo, uh, inbound for close traffic. Inbound for the south, what was your ID? A little bit of right pedal. We're at 616 Alpha 200 feet landing area is assured, we're going to continue down. A little bit of right pedal. Flare, flare, flare. Midfield right now and runway. Pedal, full throttle, there you go, good job. Ready and go ahead and take off. 35 inches, nose forward. Good. Would have been survivable. Notice you had too much left pedal, so you're coming in sideways, yeah. right? Okay. You want to keep her in trim because your 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 uh, uh, yaw string was over to the left. That means you need a little bit of right pedal to keep her in trim. And then also when you get down closer to the ground, you want to keep escape parallel to the landing direction. Okay. You don't want to be cocked off sideways trying to touch down. Yeah, so it's the time for Skid Copter 9095, Bravo Charlie. The Skid Copter 9095, Bravo Charlie. Yep, same one, straight in. Five doors, that about over there, safe. Have to pick up one more load. You got the light on? We got I the do. Roof. I probably try to ride and remain over the you interstate. The blast position, the landing light. Yep. Uh, west of the airport. Where is it? Back? Over there. Is it on? Two Back is flash. Robert Collins. Forward is oh, okay. steady. Center gotcha. is off. Nice. He's going to the Mosquito Patrol, that's a helicopter. Oh, is it? Okay. Yeah. There you go, just keep your climb up to 1,000 feet. Once you get a beam of this Cessna, you can make your turn inbound now. Yeah. Roger. Straight in again? Straight in? Straight in, yeah, straight in. And then, uh, depending on how this... Tower 5 Bravo Charlie's about 3 northwest over the interstate. 
Pietro Fire Bar, Charlie uh, Roger. Just continue southbound until you're due west of the uh, Mesquite Control, then as requested, uh, traffic ahead and to your left on the downwind of helicopter. Roger, uh, continue south over the interstate, due west of Mesquite Control, as requested. Just keep driving it forward just for a little bit. Okay, he's on the go. Already in a three, two, one, down collective, all the way down, all the way down. There you go, good. Dude. You barely lost rotor. Check it. That's it. Airspeed, rotor, landing area. Let's go, tower. RJ616, Alpha Delta, uh, base hill for go. runaway dive. Six uh, Alpha Delta, you're number two, following a helicopter over the numbers. Uh, runway nine, cleared. Touch and go. Yeah, if you touch sure. and make Coming a left traffic and report midfield each like time. Flare. Additional helicopter is low level, level just south Toronto. of the airport. There you go. All right, on the go, take her off. Good job. Clear for number two for runway nine. I have traffic inside. Door number two, clear touch and go, runway nine, or we'll make left traffic, six Alpha Delta. I think the only thing I forgot to do is give it the throttle at the last minute. Yeah, uh, I was helping you there. I was, I was going to do the auto, full auto. <laughs> <laughs> well, every one, every auto you do, if you're not ready to go below 200 feet. Right. You shouldn't go below 200 feet without power, unless you're committed to being able to land, if for whatever reason the engine doesn't come back. So that's kind of my go, no go. If I'm at 200 feet and everything's fucked up, I'm right. going around. I didn't hear you say anything. I, yeah, I, no, heard you you on a, I heard you listening to the radio, so I just, I just said, hey, we're below two, we're, we're committed. So. Yeah, we're committed, yeah. That was good. Putting the collective down, we can play with the trim a little bit better. You don't need so much left pedal. Okay. You'll notice you can uh, kind of relax on the left pedal a little bit, let the nose kind of trim a little bit better. But small things to improve, right? Power recovery is the hardest thing to do. I mean, I wish we could just do touchdown auto. I've right turned uh, southbound. I'm clear with radio for it, but it's just not. Changes off right. Second. To be able to do uh, touchdown uh, autos, this gear just can't handle through. repeated we'll touchdown autos. Five, four, five. Okay, one on short final. Space Coast Tower, helicopter 006 Alpha is a midfield left downwind runway 9. Take it to 06 Alpha, number 2, find traffic over the numbers, runway 9, clear for the option. Runway 9, clear for the option, helicopter 006 Alpha. Clear the option, rock on. Alright, so you can do a 90 degree, so turn it inside Grissom, All right. nice and close to runway 9, 90 degrees offset, and then you'll enter and turn left. Traffic's on upwind, final's clear. Alrighty, and three, two, 
One, down collective, all the way down, all the way down. There you go. Okay, checking the rotor. Airspeed, rotor, landing area, a little less left pedal, not so much left pedal. There you go. <laughs> so much wind in my face there. All right, you got the landing area shored. 200 feet, continue. Center line, looking for that center line. Cyclic flare, a little bit more flare. Level, settle, throttle, pull. Beautiful. Not so bad. All right, put your takeoff power in and get a takeoff. Better with it. Yeah, it's our Bob Charlie's left part mosquito. Uh, echo towards that field, left turn northwest. Hey, mosquito Bob Charlie, uh, as requested, the wind 0908, stay south of runway 9 until further by. 9 until further by, as long ago, Bob Charlie. Alright, I have all controls. That was funny when we called the banter. Hey, you sound grouchy. <laughs> sound grouchy. Yeah, control. It just seems like he naturally has a grouchy. I don't know why. Then when you call him on the phone, he's like Mr. Happy. I think he's just all business on the radio. Yeah. Alright, clear left. Alright, we're going to demonstrate. I haven't really practiced it in this aircraft. Fix the pedals. Let's say the pedals get stuck with a little bit of right pedal. Uh -huh. We're flying at it trip like this. We're going to have a lot of wind noise coming in on your side while I demonstrate this. Could you just take it to the interstate before you start heading north, north to us? Uh, I got the fixed wing traffic off your right side there. Uh, hopefully they'll be on our base turn prior to the interstate. Roger, I'll run it out to the interstate, then I'll go northbound. Okay, cool. You see my fixed wing? I got him in sight. Okay, cool. You're going to be following that archer the whole time in the pattern, so if you want to take those upwinds a little bit further so you can just extend downwinds, I'll get the rest up to you. Okay, we got the uh, traffic in sight, helicopter 06 south, and yeah, we'll extend the upwind next time for spacing. Okay, roger that. Yeah, you're number two to follow you, you clip the option. Clip the option, uh, runway 9 or helicopter 06 south. Bye, Vasta. Okay, so uh, you're probably going to get a lot of wind noise, so uh, hold the collective for a second. I'm going to turn the squelch up a little bit. Okay, so let's say we're flying along and we had a lot of power and we get stuck right pedal. Yep. And then when I lower the collective, it gets even worse to the right, okay? We can't move the pedals anymore now. So what we need to do is we need to fly the aircraft down to the runway to allow the nose to move to the left and execute a run-on landing. Hello, 
approach angle. Notice as I slow down, the nose will start going to the left. No pedal inputs have been made. We're going to get her down over the runway. Nose comes to the left, a little forward cycling to me. Under directional control. No pedal inputs. No pedal inputs. The whole idea is fire onto the ground. Touch. Touchdown, just like that. I got the pedals back. That's something you have to be able to do if you have a fixed pedal situation, okay? Yep. You can fix your pedals, Jeff. <laughs> so you can see, like, let's say you take off and your pedal's stuck here, you're like, ah, oh, shit. So you can still fly the aircraft, but she's going to be out of trim all the way around until you get to that sweet airspeed. Can you just put it down right here? Can I put it down here? I mean, can't you just put it down if you notice that's what's happening? I would do it. I would, 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 I would try the diagnosis program and figure out what's going on. I might be able to unjam it by manipulating the pedals. I want to give myself as much time for that. Now, if it's really, really bad, I'd have to, uh, do an auto rotation. Yep. Alright, come out on all the controls. Up on the control. We're gonna do the same thing, but I'll set it up on the final. Have all control. Just wanted to see that and then I'll have you fly it once you're on short final. I'll set up the scenario with the right pedal. Okay, right, thirty minutes. He's doing like a 52 bombing run out there, isn't he? Yep, well he's got plenty of space on us now, so the spacing works out good. Welch is good. And Space Coast Tower, helicopter 8006 Alpha, and build up down one front, why not? We have traffic inside. Helicopter 06 Alpha, cut you out the last, but what was the last thing? There we have the traffic inside. Follow that shot, number two, runway uh, nine, equip the option. Look for the option, runway nine, at the uh, number two, A006. Zero, zero, so. All right, just going to do a normal shallow approach to the numbers, runway nine. So once you're a beam of the numbers, you can do your power reduction to about 25 initial. You'll fly outbound on your downwind just a little bit. Base, final, then I'll set it up on the final. So give yourself a little bit of extended final, pass for some, some distance. Go ahead and start your power reduction. 25 initially, left pedal to keep her in trim. A normal shallow approach, like you're flying a fixed wing. A little bit more power reduction. Go. Already, base clear left. Ready, keep driving it down, driving it down. A decent shallow approach angle, so I have the pedals, relax on the pedals. You have no pedal input at this point. Oh, I have all the pedals. Okay. Already. Oh shit. Hold on. You got the controls? I have control. Sit on your hat. Okay, I'm back with you. Alright, you have control. You're right. flying sideways. I have all the pedals. Off to the right a little bit more. Try not to climb. You're still on a shallow approach, but you're flying sideways. Keep it all coming down. Your nose will go to the right, but that's.
That's fine. You want to get her over the runway at about one foot. Get her a little bit lower. Start at collective. Notice the nose goes, now forward cyclic. Now you're going to keep flying it right here. Do we? Nope, don't. Don't touch the pedals. Go forward cyclic, forward cyclic. There you go. That's how you would touch down. You have pedals now. Keep flying. I want you to see that until you touch down. So you notice if your nose goes to the left, you have to add forward cyclic to get airspeed, right? Yeah. Or a little bit of collective will help the nose go back to the right. Either one. But it's an airspeed combination to get the nose to the left and holding it there. Yeah, my head just took off. Yeah, I just... Space Tower, Arch 616 Alpha Delta, mid and left, downwind for 1089. Number 6 Alpha Delta, runway 9, clear to you. 1089, clear to you. Orange. Yeah, I was thinking that. I could go find some red yarn. I'm sure Audrey's got some. I think we have some orange paint in there, don't we? Yeah, but that thing is all tattered. It needs to be replaced. Uh, yeah. Coast Tower, Square uh, Left. Five, November 5, 2 Fox Truck, uh, Southbound, Inbound, with Romeo. Five, two, two, Fox Truck, I did. It's a year, I type landing request. Turn that squelch up a little. Okay, uh, 2 2 should please say touch and go. Uh, report a right mid to a downwind entry to runway uh, 0 9 er And uh, Space Coast Tower, helicopter 006 Alpha, midfield left downwind runway 9. 006 Alpha, you can be number 2, final traffic on a half mile final on Portman side. Number two for runway nine, we have traffic inside here. Helicopter 8006 Alpha. Helicopter 06 Alpha, Roger. Runway number two, clear touch and go. Clear touch and go for the option, uh, Helicopter 8006 Alpha. Okay, you request any option this time, uh, clear for the option. Clear for the option, uh, Helicopter 8006 Alpha. Alright, you got to 1,000 feet. We're going to do the same thing. So once you're beaming the numbers, initial power reduction, 25 inches. Start coming all down as normal shallow approach. Same thing again? Yep, the same thing. All right, click on the base leg. All right, I'm gonna help you out here. I'll get you out on that shallow approach. What'd you do? Or the collective all the way? Uh, almost. Already, here come the window is. You have control. I have control. I have the pedals. You have the pedals. There you go. Oh shit. Remember? Yep. First thing you say. That's your oh shit moment, right? Now we continue to fly.
bit lower, hold that altitude, forward cyclic, forward cyclic, forward cyclic, airspeed up, right there. You find that sweet spot, right? Touchdown. Uh, okay, good. Two, 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 I think you could have survived that. Uh, right downwind for nine. I'm going to do five shot, runway 90, clear touch and go. After touch and go, make left traffic, four to mid, till each time. You see what I'm saying with the airspeed, right? So, nose goes to the left, I need a little bit more airspeed and it comes back. If the nose goes to the right, i got to slow down a little. So it's all with the cyclic at that point, right? Collective 2 can help. But it's a combination of airspeed and power input to keep that nose as straight as possible as you touch down. Hey, Tyler, another auto. Which auto we got? Our beam of the numbers, 4 one away 9 Six up and Delta, you can extend your downwind now. You're going to be number two following Cessna on your left side, opposite downwind, report them inside. Traffic inside, extending downwind, six up and Delta. Number six up and Delta, follow that traffic. You're number six two, Alpha Delta. runway okay. uh, zero nine. All right, number two, clear touch and go, runway nine or six up and Delta. I'm going to go out just a little bit more. Sounds good. A little bit of a rain shower down there to the south. Uh -huh. well, going through the power plant. I'll bring it in. Uh, looks like it's going towards the west. It will be all right. Little light spring. No biggie. Helicopter 8006 Alpha Midfield left downwind runway. Helicopter 06 Alpha, just stay downwind. Uh, I'll call you base number 6. Send you out downwind, he'll call her base 8006 Alpha. Alright, got one on short final, another one about a mile and a half out. You got it, straight in auto, maintain altitude. Yeah, we're okay with that. Coming over here. Yeah, it looks like it's uh, staying to the south there, so I'm keeping an eye on it. Roger. Alrighty, we'll count it down in three, two, one, down, and... Did you still know when I call you crosswind? There you go. Are you calling crosswind? Six off it Down, left, aft, you got it. Airspeed, rotor, landing area, also the trim. Call it the rattle. Rotor, airspeed, trim, landing area. Steady state factors are looking good. Continue. Lower the collective. Clear. Hold it. Travel. Throttle. There you go. Alrighty. And six half a dozen. Speed now two for mid. You can start your left cross. We're for the midfield. Alright, left cross. We're approved. We'll for the midfield. Six half a dozen. Uh, 
Field downwind for uh, touch and go. Moving to two fox shot, uh, runway nine and for touch go. Looks like it's going to stay south and push towards the west. Good. Six off Delta is requesting a uh, short approach. Okay, Roger. Uh, I have a request to tell you what. Once you get a bean of numbers runway one eight, just make a right three sixty. I thought you heard me clear that guy in front of you there for a regular approach. So just make a right three sixty once you get a bean of numbers runway one eight. Alright, uh, right three sixty. Uh, right about now over uh, one eight for spacing. Six off Delta. Is there six out of change plans? Just make right traffic on this one. I got that uh, arch right there that needs a short approach. Just make right traffic. Helicopter zero six out. Right traffic for helicopter eight zero zero six out. And six out of a ski helicopter nine or nine or five Bravo Charlie's five north and five north interstate Romeo landing mosquito. Uh, mosquito Bravo Charlie, I just continue southbound on the interstate and. Uh, once you get a beam in runway 9, inspect direct, so report a beam in the numbers of runway 9 along the interstate. Beam the numbers of 9 along the interstate. Five Robert Kelly. Yeah, it looks like it'll rain itself out. It's starting to kind of dissipate. Uh, same thing again, straight in auto. You get, I think you're getting better and better. We want to make you second nature for that flare. Okay. You notice your flares are a little kind of limpy. Yeah. You can be a little bit more aggressive so you don't have all that ground run at yeah. the bottom. One helicopter is zero, zero, 06 Alpha, right at Bill Down, on the runway. Is this 6 Alpha continue? Look at this. Alright, uh, November 6th. Alpha Delta, that session's still out there on final, so making another right 360. Alright, we can just do a normal landing if that works for you, 6 Alpha Delta. Yeah, either one works for me. Uh, if you want to do a normal landing, just follow the session and half my final, clear touch and go. And after you're touch and go, you can make a left downwind departure. Our traffic is on the right, right, uh, uh, left downwind right now. Runway Niner, and uh, we'll make a left downwind departure. I got him in sight, right shoulder. And the helicopter, uh, zero 06 Alpha, make a wide left 360. Right left 360, helicopter 806 out. Not as nice as yesterday was. Nope. Just continue down this way a little bit. Yeah, no worries. 45 minutes of run time. You still got 30 minutes of flight time available. All right, you go. Keep that turn coming in now for him. I'm going to go past the Christian Parkway and then just keep turning. How's that? Yeah, there's no way we'll be uh, pretty much on two. Yeah, that'll work. I just want to piss off Andrew. Right. <laughs> Hey guys, if I could just turn it final out there, it's three mile final. I know, that's why I was telling you, slow turn, yeah. Yeah, I love 06 out for you. Tell you problems at Archer, about a mile final, report them in sight. Okay, we have them in sight for a helicopter, 806 out. There's just six out to follow that traffic, your number two, down low. Uh, low approach, yep. and uh, if you would just maintain that above a thousand feet, start your final turn. I got mosquito patrol in down. All right, that's uh, uh, clear for the. Uh, Clear for the option runway 9, we'll follow traffic and we'll keep it at 1,000 feet. We're turning now, uh, and we'll up right there with us to go. Roger that, yeah, and I cleared you for the low approach. If you want the option, you clear for the option now. Clear for the option, helicopter right there with us to go. And Mosquito Patrol, you can see that's requested. Uh, you want to do it straight one, in, Otto? 110 yep. zero and 10. Plenty of clearance there, Robert looking good. All right, we are clear for the option. Everything's looking good. Temperature, pressures. Was 11.5 on the AFR. Looks like they either paved or painted new lines on the uh, the perimeter road down there. Looks nice. 
The racetrack road? Yeah, the racetrack road. Uh -huh. Looks nice, man. Maybe you should get the motorcycles out sometime. Yep. Okay. Countdown in three, two, one. A down collective. All the way down. All the way down. Half cycling. Feet continue. Flare, flare, flare. There you go. Good. Got it. Got jumpy on those pedals. Yep. Another one? Is that what you want to do? You yeah. want to try the 180? Yeah, we can try the 180. Okay, we'll try the 180. So come on, you're upwind. Turn your downwind. Keep it tight over the tree line there. Oh, let's ask him uh, left or right traffic. I, I don't know what, what side he needs this on. That's our whole coverage. Here. That's six alpha. You want to slip that one? Uh, yeah, you can back to left traffic and put the midfoot downwind. Okay, we'll report the left midfield that one. All the cover is zero, zero, six out. Okay. Weather staying south of the field looks good. We'll extend her up one just a little bit. Okay, again. Gonna extend her up with just a little bit, go to one, and then we'll turn left. Sounds good. That guy's going out like three miles doing finals. Number six out the Delta Cross on the Interstate 95 for exchange we approve. The interstate frequency station. Sounds Cruise like he's leaving now. Delta. Good. Sounds like the guy left. Just request the option. One here in midfield. We good on time. Say again. We good on time. Yeah. And helicopter eight zero zero six off of midfield left now and uh, one way nine request option. Helicopter zero six off you number two following traffic over the numbers from way nine clear for the option. Up nine clear for the option and one number two helicopter eight zero zero six off. Okay, everything's set up good here, so basically what you're going to be looking for, I'll count it down for you, but the numbers, once the number 9 is on your left knee, that's when we're going to enter. I'm going to have you stay straight for 1,001 and 1,002 count. So 1,001, 1,002, then we'll start to turn 180. We're going to see if we can get close to the, the, the number 9. Okay. Uh, number 225, try to favor turn right on Charlie, then contact Oh, we got to keep going. Right on, Charlie. I think okay. we'll be fine. Three, two, one. Down, lift it. 1,001, 1,002, start to turn. Here, checking the rotor, looks good. Point the nose down for airspeed. And canceling the horn. Oh, yeah, this is looking good. Rotor, airspeed, and landing area. Yep, you got it. Pedal. All right, well, that's it. A little bit more, a little bit more flare. Pedal. Pedal. Pull. Ooh. And you would have passed the check right, right there. Beautiful. Look at that. All right, take off. Let's do it one more time. 
So you say what I said, delay the turn yeah. to make the spot. If you were at 600 feet, you would have to turn immediately, but at 1,000, that's usually a 1 Mississippi, 2 Mississippi, 1,000, 1,002 count, and then start to turn. So it worked out pretty good. I could, I could have done it much better myself. You what? I said I could have done that much better myself. That was good. Got another storm coming in over there. Yeah, further out over Merritt Island. This one looks like it's uh, going to stay south of us. Temperatures, everything looking good. That's uh, good. About two, I'd say about eight gallons burned in uh, 53 minutes. Give or take, so. Probably got about 16 gallons total on board, so we still got another seven gallons or so available to us. All right, everything's the same for the setup. All right. And just make sure you're requesting the option for the runway there, so. All right. That tower helicopter 006 Alpha is midfield left down one runway nine, request option. Helicopter 06 Alpha, runway nine, clear for the option. Runway nine, clear for the option, helicopter 006 Alpha. You want to bring it in after this, or? Yep, that'll be a solid hour for you after that, so. All right, get your 1,000 feet. 1,000 feet, 70 miles an hour, give or take, for the entry. Positioning looks good. I don't know what you're doing there. I had to put some more rudder in there. <laughs> you didn't need that much. I know. All right, there you go, level off, get your airspeed built up. Once again, you're gonna stay straight for about two seconds, so 1,001. 1,002, down collective, all the way down, all the way down, all the way down. 1,001, 1,002, turn. Slow turn, slow turn. Look at your desired landing area. There you go. We're going to kind of use the wind to our advantage to push us over. So we're going to be long, but that's fine. I always like to look at my desired landing area before I turn. Okay. Airspeed, rotor RPM, we're looking good, that'll work, there you go, throttle, that would have been a really good touchdown auto, alright, I have all controls, do you have control, alright, I'm going to get to do one myself, got to show me up, well, I want to try to hit that spot, I think it's a good option to bring it on in. That one looks like it's going to come this way. Yeah. You want to do an auto on 3-6 with a crosswind? <laughs> yeah. Helicopter zero six Alpha midfield downwind runway nine request the option. Helicopter zero six Alpha runway nine request the option. 
Runway we nine, clear the option. Helicopter zero six up. Like it's raining over there, almost to the hangars now. Yeah. All right, coming up on our thousand feet, right before we hit the entry point. A little bit more, a little bit more. Okay, three, two, one, down left aft. Thousand one, thousand two, thousand three. Now we're gonna start turning. We're looking for my spot, right? Low turning. 107 is still good. Now I'm gonna turn harder because the wind's pushing me out. Trying to make the spot, right? Rotor airspeed. The landing air is gonna be a little short. They're gonna be a little short, yep. Yeah. So, you can see, that's a little bit of an art form to try to make it. Yep. Alrighty. Ah, oh, tower helicopter zero six off. It looks like that rain's starting to come in. Can we air taxi back to the southeast T hangar ramp? Okay, I'll exit at Charlie and contact ground. I'll come to 06 Alpha. Thanks. There's ground. I'll flip the over. Roger that. I'll demonstrate the quick stop, right? Just like an auto. Just do a quick turn. Oh, you can do that too. That's almost like flaring an auto. That's a good way to warm up. Okay, I see ground. Space Coast Ground, helicopter 8006 off the clearing, runway 9, full parking, southeast T hangar ramp. Helicopter 8006 off of Space Coast to Ground, uh, air taxi 2, parking via direct, cross runway 36. Via direct air taxi, cross runway 36, helicopter 06 off the parking. Looks like we're going to get the rain. Yeah. We might get the rain. Perfect. A little bit more. How's that? Good. Look at the left half skid. Good. That's good. That's on. All righty. All right. Hop on out, man. Get your windows there so your car doesn't get soaked.